Indian Rivers Interlinking Project. The Indian Rivers Interlinking Project is a proposed large-scale civil engineering project. The rain across the nation is not uniform. The east and the north gets most of the rain, while the west and south gets less. India also sees years of excess monsoons and floods, followed by below average or late monsoons with droughts. These geographical variations raised issues in availability of water and the demand for irrigation, drinking and industrial water creates a demand supply gap that has been worsening with India's rising population. Thus, the main aim of this project is to manage water resources in India effectively by linking Indian rivers by a network of reservoirs and canals. It will enhance irrigation and groundwater recharge, reduce persistent floods in some parts and water shortages in other parts of India. The interlink project has been planned to proceed further by splitting into three parts, a northern Himalayan rivers interlink component, a southern peninsula component and an intrastate rivers linking component. This project is being managed by India's National Water Development Agency and WDA under the supervision of Ministry of Jal Shakti of Government of India. And WDA has studied and prepared reports on 67 interlink projects all over India. The proposal of interlinking of rivers in India has a long history. The plan to interlink major Indian rivers was proposed by an engineer, Arthur Cotton, in 19th century during the British colonial rule. After independence, a dam designer and former irrigation minister of India, Dr. K. L. Rao, proposed National Water Grid in 1970s. This project is formally known as the National Perspective Plan. The total estimated for implementation of this project is Rs. 5,60,000 crores at 2002 price levels with Rs. 16,000 crores over 35 years every year. And WDA has identified 14 links under Himalayan Rivers component, 16 links under Peninsular Rivers component, and 37 links under an interstate river linking component for interbasin transfer of water till today under the National Perspective Plan NPP prepared by Ministry of Water Resources. This project of interlinking of rivers is of national importance. It is put on high priority. Purpose of this project is to control the issue of drought in several parts of the country. It is also said to be helpful in flood management. It will help in combating the problem of water scarcity. Interlinking of rivers will make navigation easy across India for logistics and freight movement. First linking was completed of rivers Krishna and Godavari on 16 September 2015. Some activists have also questioned the merits of this project. There has always been a question on benefits and risks to environment and ecology from the projects which has been completed so far.